waves. Hi, hello, and how are you? How are you? How are you? Hi, hello, and how are you? How are you today? How are you today? I'm very well. Hello, and welcome to Story Time at State Library Victoria. And hello to Susan, who's doing our Auslan signing today. Waiting to Susan too? Now, I acknowledge that I live on the land of the Wurundjeri people and I pay my respects to elders past, present and emerging. And I think we should all acknowledge that we live on Aboriginal land. Are you ready to clap your hands? Happy? It's Aboriginal land, clap your hands. It's Aboriginal land, clap your hands. It's Aboriginal land. Always was and always will be. It's Aboriginal land, clap your hands. How about we stamp our feet? It's Aboriginal land, stamp your feet. It's Aboriginal land, stamp your feet. It's Aboriginal land, always was and always will be. It's Aboriginal land, stamp your feet. Oh, lots of stamping. How about we wave our arms? Oh, good waving. It's Aboriginal land, wave your arms. It's Aboriginal land, wave your arms. It's Aboriginal land, always was and always will be. It's Aboriginal land, wave your arms. Good waving. Now, while you've got your hands in the air, can you open and shut them? That's the way. Do you know that song? Open, shut them. Open, shut them. Give a little clap. Open, shut them. Open, shut them. Lay them in your lap. Very good. Creep them, creep them, creep them, creep them. Right up to your chin. Open wide your little mouth. But do not let them in. Do not let them in. Did you let them in? No. How about we do topsy-turvy upside down. Open, shut them. It's very silly. This is open and this is shut them and this is clapping. Are you ready to be that silly? Let's see if I can do it. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Give a little clap, I missed. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Lay them in your lap. That's not your lap. Creep them, creep them, creep them, creep them. Right up to your chin, down to your toes. Open wide your little mouth. But, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh, uh, it's topsy turvy, you let them in. How about we give them a shake? Shake them, shake them them, shake them, shake them, shake them just like this. Roll them, roll them, roll them, roll them. Blow a little kiss. Oh, oh, I'm getting lots of kisses. I'm catching them. Oh, and another one. Thanks for all the kisses. How about some counting today? Do you know how to count? One, two, three, four, five. How about Five cheeky monkeys swinging in the tree. Have you got your monkeys ready? Five cheeky monkeys swimming in the tree. Teasing Mr. Crocodile. You can't catch me, you can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Crocodile, as quiet as can be, and snap. <gasps> How many cheeky monkeys are left now? One, two, three, four. You got your four monkeys? Four cheeky monkeys.
Frisky swinging in the tree, teasing Mr. Crocodile. He can't catch me. He can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Crocodile, as quiet as can be, and snap! <gasps> How many cheeky monkeys are there now? One, two, three. Ooh, have you got your three monkeys ready? Three cheeky monkeys swimming, singing in the tree, teasing Mr. Crocodile. You can't catch me, you can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Crocodile, as quiet as can be, and snap! <gasps> How many cheeky monkeys are left now? One, two, <gasps> only two. Two cheeky monkeys. He's swinging in the tree, a teasing Mr. Crocodile. You can't catch me, you can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Crocodile, as quiet as can be, and snap! How many cheeky monkeys are left now? Only one. Only one cheeky monkey. Are you ready? One cheeky monkey swinging in the tree, teasing Mr. Crocodile. He can't catch me, he can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Crocodile, as quiet as can be, and snap! <gasps> you missed me, you missed me! One cheeky monkey gets away. Are you a cheeky monkey? I like being a cheeky monkey too. Now it's time to see who our special guest is today who's going to read us a story. Let's see if they're here. Are you here, Kate? Hi, Julianne, I'm here. Hi, Susan. Hi, Hi everyone. Now our special guest today is my boss, the <laughs> CEO of the library, Kate Tawney. <laughs> Hello. Thank you for having me. I'm so excited to be here. Now, I'd just like everyone to know that that means story time is really important because even the big boss comes to story time. <laughs> it's the most important thing at the library, <laughs> knowing stories. Now, Kate, what's your favourite thing about the library? Well, my favourite thing about the library, there's lots and lots to choose from, but one of my favourite things at the library is the big castle in the children's area of the library. So if you haven't come to discover our beautiful castle, when we reopen, it's something that you can come and have a look at. I can't wait to have kids back in the library in the Pauline Gandle Children's Quarter. It's going to be so much fun. I hope you all come and see me when we reopen. Now, Kate, we're taking part in Australia Reads this week. It runs from the 1st of November to the 12th of November, and it's an initiative that celebrates the joy of reading. Now, I know you're a big reader, so I think there's nothing better than reading aloud. What do you think? I completely agree. I love, 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 love reading, but there's nothing like reading to other people and reading beautiful books. What book have you got for us today? Today, Julianne, I've got a gorgeous book. It's called Under the Love Umbrella and it's written by Davina Bell and the illustrations are by Alison Colpoise and it's by Scribble. It's been published by Scribble and it's a fantastic book. So can I get underway? Can I get started? I think it's time to listen to the story. I'll bring down the silent curtain so that we all know to shh. Okay, so under the love umbrella. There are lots of umbrellas inside this book. Can you help us find them all? And here we've got Joe and we've got Brian and we've got Grace and Izzy. Up in the sky amongst the stars, there's something you might not see. Anything that you can see here? Just stars, but the outline of an umbrella. But over your head and just above, there's an umbrella of my love to show it's you I'm thinking of, wherever you might be. 
in deepest dark. Can you see he's in the dark? When a big dog barks or waves crash loud. Is that a shark? When friends won't share and things aren't fair, there's always room under my love umbrella. When everything is strange and new, can you see there's a moving van, they're moving into a new house. On days when you need super glue, can you see here they've dropped a box of toys, maybe some toys are broken. There's so much room here just for you under my love umbrella. A bad dream, lost tooth, smashed toy, big worry. Your pants are wet. You're meant to hurry. It disappears in a big old flurry under a love umbrella. Whatever you fear, come close, my dear. You're tucked in safe for always here and I will never not be near holding our love umbrella. In every weather, it's us together. My love for you goes on forever. See all the kites in the sky. Be still, breathe deep. Wherever you sleep, you're under my love umbrella. Up in the sky, amongst the stars, there's something you might not see. But over your head and just above, there's an umbrella of my love to show you that it's you I'm thinking of, wherever you might be. See something there? I think it's an umbrella, the fireworks. Who's under your love umbrella? That's our book for today. That's such a beautiful book, isn't it? It's so nice that I've got it on my shelf too. <laughs> Perhaps some of you read along with Kate because it's a very lovely book, isn't it? It always makes me think of all the people I love. Now, Kate, would you like to stay and do some actions to some songs? I would love to stay. Thanks, Julianne. Well, I Thank noticed you. in the book, one of the pictures was by the sea. And I thought that we could sing my favourite silly song, which is A Sailor Went to Sea, Sea, Sea. Great. Very silly. <laughs> Are you ready, everyone? A sailor went to sea, 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 to see what she could see, see, see. But all that she could see, see, see was the bottom of the deep blue sea, sea, sea. Now we go to chop, chop, chop. A sailor went to chop, chop, chop to see what she could chop, chop, chop. But all that she could chop, chop, chop was the bottom of the deep blue chop, chop, chop. Now we're going to go to Wendy. A sailor went to knee, knee, knee to see what she could knee, knee, knee. Don't fall over. But all that she could knee, knee, knee was the bottom of the deep blue knee, knee, knee. Now we've got to go all the way to our toes. A sailor went to toe, toe, toe to see what she could. Toe, toe, toe. I think I am going to fall over. But all oh, that she could toe, toe, toe was the bottom of the deep blue toe, toe, toe. Oh. <laughs> now we go to Timbuktu. Are you ready? A sailor went to Timbuktu to see what she could Timbuktu. But all oh, that she could Timbuktu was the bottom of the deep blue Timbuktu. Okay, I warned you it was silly. Now we have to put everything together. Can you remember what all of those things were? See, chop, knee, toe, Timbuktu. <laughs> Can you do it? I'll try. A sailor went to see, chop, knee, toe, Timbuktu. To see what she could see, chop, knee, toe, Timbuktu. 
But all that she could see, Chop Knee Toe Timbuktu was the bottom of the deep blue. See Chop Knee Toe Timbuktu. Oh, have a good wriggle. We did it. We got through the silliest song I know. Oh. Now, also in the book, it said, no matter what the weather. Was that what it said? Yes. No matter what the weather, we stick together. Now, I know a song that has a little bit of weather in it. It has some rain and it has the sun coming out. Can you guess what it is? Yes. Incy Wincy Spider. Do we know that one? Have you got your spider? You could go like that or like that. I think I'll do the old fashioned way. Are you ready? Incy Wincy Spider climbed up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed poor Incy out. Out came the sunshine and dried up all the rain. So Incy Wincy Spider climbed up the spout again. Well done, Incy. I think we'll do that one again too. Incy Wincy Spider climbed up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed poor Incy out. Oh dear. Out came the sunshine and dried up all the rain. So Incy Wincy Spider climbed up the spout again. Well done, Incy Wincy. It's very good. Now, also in the book, it said, up in the sky, amongst the stars. Shall we sing Twinkle Twinkle? Have you got your stars ready? Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Good twinkling, good twinkling, Kate. Now, that's all we have time for today at Storytime. I hope you loved being under our love umbrella. And a big thank you to Kate for reading our book this week, thank which you. was Under the Love Umbrella by Davina Bell and Alison Colpois. Now, all we have time for, Kate, is the goodbye song. And the goodbye song is actually exactly the same as the hello song, <laughs> except we sing goodbye. <laughs> so everybody waving, what sort of a wave are you going to do? A big wave, a little wave, a fluttery wave, a smooth wave, a wave like the Queen. Have you got your wave ready? Goodbye, goodbye, I'll see you soon, see you soon, see you soon. Goodbye, goodbye, I'll see you soon on another day. Keep waving. Goodbye, goodbye, I'll see you soon, see you soon, see you soon. Goodbye, goodbye, I'll see you soon on another day. And I will see you soon on another day at story time at State Library Victoria. Thanks for watching everyone. Have a great day.